guys, welcome to the Showstopper Shows. Today I have Gold Peak Coffee. I did just review the Dunkin' Donuts cold brew coffee. I've done the Starbucks versions as well in the bottle where they, you know, they've had those around for a long time. Where it's like iced, like iced coffee that's already cold and you get it in the cooler. This is Gold Peak Coffee, cold brew flavored. It's salted caramel, feature real milk, of course, and then they have sugar. It has 53 grams of sugar in this bottle, 270 calories as well. They are distributed by the cold, by the Coca-Cola company. It says real cream and real sugar. So I always prefer the real as opposed to the fake most of the time. I'm going to shake it up here. And this is something that's probably good to pour it over ice as well, but I'm just going to go ahead and pour it in my cup here. It's been in my fridge all day and all night, so let's go ahead and taste the, uh, look at this here. There it is. Mmm, it smells good. It smells like I smell the salted caramel. It smells very caramely. Mmm, there we go. All right, so remember to eat and drink things that aren't good for you. Moderation. Food and drinks last longer, so will you, and that's what we all want here. Show us off the population. Everybody in the world. That's right. All right, so let's go ahead and taste this. Guys, raising the glasses for the masses. <laughs> All right, guys, so I've taken several drinks of this from the bottle, from the cup. The aftertaste, which I get right now, kind of just after you have swallowed and kind of get that back end flavor, is a good coffee kind of flavor. The initial drink, it's very, it's kind of thin. It doesn't remind me, I don't know what that, it's just weird. It doesn't have to seem. It doesn't seem to have a whole lot of flavor for me. I'm kind of disappointed with this, to be honest with you. I'm not feeling this at all. Has a distinct milky flavor. Kind of reminds me of like a chocolate milk, but like a thin, watered down skim milk kind of thing. It's like it's the thin version of something good. It's kind of the watered down version of something good. And it does say it has skim milk in here. As I look at the ingredients, it also has cream. And then nowhere does it say caramel. It must do something together to make the caramel flavor. I'm not feeling that at all, guys. If you're comparing to the Dunkin' Donuts uh, bottle of coffee, I would definitely reach for Dunkin' as opposed to the Gold Peak version distributed by the Coca-Cola company. So I'm not feeling that one at all. Again, it's not atrocious. It's not despicable, but it's certainly not kicking like I want it to. The flavor is not happening there, guys. That's my honest showstopper review so what i have right here i'm gonna go ahead and get my rating that's a showstopper mizzle and i'm gonna give that an overall score of 66. So if you want to go try that out for yourself and let me know what you think in the comments below if you get that if you're comparing it to say the dunkin donuts which i'm kind of doing but it also reminds me of like uh the coffee flavored yoohoo so there you go that's what i'm feeling right there with this beverage so don't forget to subscribe to my channel hey may the forks be with you May his presence be with you always. Put a bow on this video, because that is a wrap. <sighs> the show stops here. Never quit, y'all. We ain't never gonna quit it.